Ryan Murphy, your top qualifier in tonight's final. Swimming in lane four from California Aquatics. He's the Olympic gold medalist. Doing a 100 back, 200 back, and also on the 400 meter medley relay. Murphy does have a full body length lead here coming into the backstroke flags for the turn at the 100 meter mark. 56-63 for Ryan Murphy. 58-94, Chris Reed in three. Then it'll be Anthony Rinkin in lane six. 59-25. Gleason five was next to turn. That's your top four. They're all trying to chase down Ryan Murphy in lane number four. He's now moved down to about two body links. Murphy now three body lengths of the lead. He's now picking up his pace midway through the pool, 25 meters to go, less than. Chris Reed in lane three is the one trying to chase him down. Close race there for third position between Song and Glees, but it'll be Ryan Murphy, 156.06. A 159.60 for Chris Reed in lane number three. Then it will be Rimkin in six with a, a 202. 37. Ladies and gentlemen, your board's unofficial, but your champion for the men's 200 meter backstroke, swimming in lane number four, Ryan Murphy. Two minutes here in the final with Rincon in third, and Ryan Murphy is with us. Fastest time in the world this year. What part of that race pleased you the most, Ryan? Uh, I mean, I think that my my goal going into that was to try to be pretty solid on that that second and third 50. I think uh, it's nice coming to these meets. It's it's nice to kind of just play around with some race strategy. I think you've got to be decently versatile in the way you can swim it. So. Tried to swim in a little bit different this time as compared to last meet. And it really seems to me, especially the last couple of months throughout the fall season, obviously, just swimming a lot of, with a lot of confidence, Ryan. Is, is that true? And, and what's the difference? Yeah, I, I mean, I think I, I am swimming with confidence. And I think ultimately.